We have to preserve our existing infrastructures. The 2022 Transportation, Preservation and Improvements Project is underway. We're working on Longs Peak Street, Main Street, 50th Avenue, as well as a whole slew of different streets, including certain residential subdivisions. Public Works Assistant Director Christopher Montoya says residents have expressed their priorities for getting around Brighton by having safe streets to drive on. Secondarily, we hear a lot of bike lanes. There's a, there's a demand from the public for bike lanes. Montoya says the project is also a great way to make improvements to the city's infrastructure. And then finally, sidewalks. I want to see more and more sidewalks, the widening of sidewalks like we're doing on this project on Main Street and making that, that accessibility. Montoya says some of the other key features of the transportation project includes traffic calming, safety improvements, asphalt maintenance, signage, and pavement markings. Also, that's a chance to start targeting some of the other features on that, that roadway. Maybe it's a pedestrian sign with the rapid flashing beacon. It could be an enhanced pedestrian crossing that we create more of a narrow crossing, reducing the width that a pedestrian crosses, enhancing the way that the striping is for those crosswalks. Staff with Public Works is already working one step ahead and starting to plan the 2023 Transportation, Preservation and Improvement Project. Not only are we picking our roadway segments, but we're using our asset management systems to identify certain infrastructure that is now ready or has a need for certain improvements. The asset management system also looks at pavement conditions, traffic volumes, transportation demand, in addition to other criteria. This helps staff prioritize and identify site-specific locations that can be included in next year's project. As staff works to finalize the project for 2023, the 2022 Transportation, Preservation and Improvement Project will be completed in the spring of next year.